Oh my god! Hey Pablo, Pablo. you did the right thing. <laughs> Racked up in my city, I feel like the mayor Cause I could tell them boys chill, I could tell them slay it Drink plug in the south, we met him in Decatur Ballin' in Florida, I feel like a gator Pink Molly look like salt from the Himalayas Dior runners all summer, I got different flavors Blanca Lotto so loud that it could wake the neighbors Since Corona, when we count, we oh lights all the paper God. Do me a favor, never do me no favors Everybody on my team pull felonious capers Gotta hustle every day, it's just part of my nature I'm doing better than a lot of rappers signed to a major She said I get that pussy wet, she make it leak for me Quit the class, hey Azul, that shit too sweet for me Back on 1942, I got this tree on me So the geek called me, said you really got the streets, homie My mind stayed similar to Donald Goins Writing about my life, got me on tour in Des Moines I may be in Missouri, new fans that never heard me Listening to hot trap and so snow by the flurry Go change Jordan 5's when my homie got buried At the wake I couldn't cry but my vision was blurry The whole city OD'ing, they addicted to 30's But I'm addicted to bad bitches, the slim thick and curvy Had a gun the size of Raw's back when 50 was curly Cross the line I do him bad and have him sit in the gurney You beefing on the internet, I know you sing to a jury Look, Balenciaga on my body, that shit oversized Off the drink, so the pink got me comatized Top dog in my city, bitch, I'm bonafide These bitches choosing off the rip, I let her hold the size Last text I got from Shotty said you know the vibes Hot-blooded, cold world, it got me frozen inside You weak bitches in my text is getting no replies You was fronting back then, so how you so surprised? Seeing death around the corner, life getting scary me against the world, I'm not gonna hell marry. Illuminati got me feeling like Tupacalypse. I would have been on top of the charts, but it's politics. You do some gimmick shit and post, you get a lot of clicks. Drop some real shit and they probably won't acknowledge it. Record labels tell you take your pride and swallow it. So I keep one foot in the trap to make these dollars flip. Oh my God. Boston's own. Listen, man, that's Boston's own, man. Millie's, listen, man. That Himalaya, but you got to go check out that Block 03 out right now, man. My man from Boston, Millie's Blanco man. But you know what? You're now tuned into me, 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 million dollars worth of game. Listen, powered, powered by Barstool Sports. I'm Wallow267. This is uh, Gilly the... N- what the fuck I tell you? Didn't I tell you that shit? You said I flinched. I ain't going to huh? I flinched. You got me. Um, but I'm just saying, stop that shit. All right, man. You know what I mean, I'm glad it's not just the pips and all that shit. You feel like the pips? No, don't call me white you, girl. Oh, okay. It's cool. me. Mm-hmm. People's champ. Hey, he won't keep bad. saying, I'm Wanye, this new edition. <laughs> she Diana Ross. Diana Floss. Diana Supreme. Diana Noss. <laughs> Noss. <laughs> <laughs> they missed me, y'all. They missed me. Diana, yeah, Diana you know, Noss. I miss you. He missed me. <laughs> Diana <laughs> Loss. <laughs> I told you, Mr. Tony Ray Tackle. Uh-huh, look at him. I didn't want to your clothes. What's up, y'all? I go by the name of Gilly the King. Man. She talked about we missed you. I, did you miss me? Dig with your girl right there, Faye. How are you? Uh, look at you. Please, she's... she's Look at they love you. Listen, I'm recording right now. Not right now. I like your sweatshirt too. I gotta go. I love you. But listen, the whole twist is this, man. At the end of the day, it's like this. We're gonna get right into this. We're gonna get into these sponsors. Uh, Mona was shooting pornos, but that's another story. We're gonna talk about that. The porno <laughs> yeah, life. XXX Mona, XX, Mona. Mona. I did do a porn. Uh, and, and she just, did a just, porno. Okay, and just for the record, Mona wasn't here because she was indulging in the porn industry. Yeah, she tried porn. You know, it's, it's a big story. This shit know, is big. We're going to get into that. She was charging a stack to break her back. Just stay tuned. Give us a Yeah, you know I mean? <laughs> we got to get to the ads first. Mm, get to the ads, Gil. So no, we no, get no, into let's, let's get to how you was taking a stack to break your back. It was a little more than a stack. Oh, okay. And I didn't even Hold take on, so my this jeans true? off. I did a porn. Oh, so you're saying I for $2 and you're a holler, huh? I did a porn, and it was amazing. Mm. I really what like you did? Did you do? Well, you, basically, I got. I don't know if you young you motherfuckers HJ, know. You did the HJ porn. You know, being you two niggas know being older niggas. Um, Luke did it. Jay Z did it. You do an interview and people have live sex in front of you. I think it's more about being able to keep your cool. Answer. So no, I watch somebody get cool. dog from the back, and I'm just chilling, answering questions. No, oh, no, they they said. Uh, I'm not even going to say what well, you like. What yeah, happened. she was giving out HJs in her hand, y'all. My jeans stay <sighs> well, on. Listen, this episode of me and I was worth a game is brought to you by. 
New Amsterdam Vodka. New Amsterdam Vodka was born from an uncompromising passion for great vodka. New Amsterdam Vodka is 80 proof vodka made from the finest quality of America's heartland. It's distilled five times and it's filtered three times. Shout out to the N, uh, NAQ, the New Amsterdam Queen, my wife. She loves to make uh, you know all Shout types of too. cocktails with her girlfriends. You know, New Amsterdam Vodka is the official vodka. For me and I was worth a game at Barstool Sports. So um, make sure you go get you some New Amsterdam vodka immediately. Please. You know, and enjoy and drink responsibly. You know, that's what it's all about. New Amsterdam vodka. Now back to the life of a porn star. Like, how do you enter the life? Did you have to take your AIDS test first? Like, what was going on? Well, being that I never got touched, I didn't have to do anything. I did get COVID tested, so everything was safe. But I just got interviewed while they were fucking, and it was pretty cool. I'm like a bucket list person. So, so, so let me ask you this cool. question. Huh? All of y'all, why do the I got an guy? interview while two people were fucking, and the guy that was fucking the girl was trying to holler at me, like he was totally like, "What's up? What's up?" Still fucking, yeah. which proves that niggas ain't shit. <laughs> so that one is bitch. So what? Uh, so, like, goddamn, give so him some attention. Bitch, was you hammer watching? Tell the truth. Yeah, she. Was I looked at his gay a little bit because it was so hard. Like, wow. So you never had no type that type you of action. Never I've so never seen a get that hard. They, they fucking you with slinkies. So. <laughs> you know, a lot of these niggas coming with ball. this. A lot of niggas okay. coming like this oh, no, nowadays. They drinking that bullshit <laughs> They not run hard. Right? 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 Mona, Mona loves some DD, some dead <laughs> dick. It's almost like. It's some almost like, dick. <laughs> it's almost like your dick on Amsterdam oh or off God. the Amsterdam. <laughs> you know what I mean? On the Amsterdam, I'm sure Gil giving them this, but off is No, 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 no. You crazy as shit. I breezes the shit out of her. I call her right now. She'll tell you my dick stay hard in Russian Jeopardy. Is the dick hard <laughs> on the Amsterdam? No, 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 no. My dick is hard off of marijuana. That's it. We need Tootie up here. Fuck it. Hold on. I'll call her right now. Call no, Tootie then. Don't call Tootie. What's wrong with you? I ain't call got no Tootie problem then. calling Tootie. Ask her too. Do I, got a hard, do I got a problem with this dick stand up? Or do it look like an old Fuck cucumber? What's wrong with shit? Look like a motherfucker. I ain't listen. Let me just stop. Let me look stop. like bok choy. Let me stop talking to you. Let me ask you all, all right. this question, right? It's getting a million dollars worth of game. Why are the good guys losing? Um, I think it got a lot to do with the president. Hmm? I think it has no, a lot no, no, to do no, with no, the no, no. I'm talking about life in general. Like the good guys be finishing last a lot of times. Why yeah. is that, Lo? I don't I don't know. Hmm? I just hey, you gotta go a little deeper than that. What, what do you mean, good guys finish last? What do you mean? They doing everything. The what girls don't like the good guys. Right, absolutely. Like they just lose. Like they looked at it as like suckers. But I just feel like the the bar is lower because now the thing that's supposed to be super important is what you have. I'm as not far talking as about in life because a lot of times the good guys win in life. Look, what the fuck are you doing over here, man? Playing with his toys. Like. You want Look some super duper nut shit? She Your probably won't answer the phone for you, though. She don't respect you like message. that. What's she gonna tell you? She gonna tell you this motherfucking dick stand up like a motherfucker, uh, the city at a Please. motherfucking parade that just won the Super Bowl. No, see, Everybody standing the fuck up. Fuck is wrong with you? Or is it you, iffy? Is it sometimes? No, 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 no. That's what I want to know. Sometimes, no, no, no. Wallow sometimes. He burnt his fucking stale out. His his stem out in jail, jerking the fuck off twenty seven thousand fucking times. And they in actually jail. say when you jack off, that's good for keeping your shit strong. It's sport, but listen, you would know. He's just, he just running around he tackling. He's jerk. tackling his own dick for no reason. Oh, I'm a tackler. I, mean, I beat my meat once a day. It's a fact. Good for Whoa. you. Love yourself. Shit, it's called self care. I haven't fuck fucking ru- I haven't rubbed one out in a while. I think that's part of my problem. Nigga, so you out here on the streets jerking off for no reason? As you should, brother. Hey man, I wake up in the morning. I'm gonna get one out. Get my day self-care. started. Self care. Get it going. Is you a shower guy? No, I just wear bed, let that shower. shit run on your feet. Uh, so let me just tell you this. So let me just tell you this. Did the dude ever let some shit run off your feet? Make sure we don't be. Make make sure we don't be fucking shaking hands first thing in the fucking morning. Since you got to get hey, one listen. out first thing if in the fucking morning. If you beat off in the shower, it's clean. I'm not, it's no, cool. why would you be beating off? You got bitches out here in the world. It's called self care, loving the yourself. You, first of all, let me hey, just tell you something. You come on the second. Let me just tell you something. You know the second. Let me just is the one. Let me just say something. Why I gotta rub one out? When I got Tootie laying in the bed. Tootie, let me tell you something. Tootie, vagina, is the cable box and my dick is the remote. I turn that motherfucker on and off when the fuck I want. Why the fuck? First of all, first of all, Tootie laying in the bed. I'm going to go in the bathroom and jerk off. That's weirdo shit. Jerk off on the butt cheek. No, 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 no. Why? That happened to you before? Why would I jerk off? Why would I squeeze one out on the ass when I could squeeze one out? That happened in real life. life. How many so you telling you? me you haven't rubbed one out at all? You've been married for a thousand years. You don't rub one out ever. No, I, I, I didn't say that. Thank you for your honesty. Move on. 
But, but, but no, 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 no. Two be jerking. gone for six months at a time. Right. So, of course, I'm going to hit the ceiling with that motherfucker. Like, Poof. Oh, now let me wipe the ceiling off. Right. <laughs> what are you talking about? Fuck out of here, man. This nigga's crazy, man. He's insane. What, type of, what type of movies you watch? <laughs> he don't need that. I don't need no fucking movies. Just go to the memory bank. All right, now listen. I pick a pair of two Moni, panties up. That? Poor, I make it too hard. Face, smell Moni, how many times? Damn, you nasty. How many times do squeeze off on you? Crusty. I've had a guy jerk off on my ass before. Out of frustration. What do you mean? I play with the K. Uh, I'm the type of person I play with the K. Even if we already fuck it, I still turn you down. Right. Fuck it. Did a guy ever get your butt? Yeah, I want to know. Did a guy ever get your butt pregnant? Like in the butthole? God like he, damn, he ever got your butt it? pregnant? Listen, could, back up. No, I haven't had no ass pregnancies. None of that. I said oh. the nigga jerked off on my butt. <laughs> Any of your girlfriends did. Come on, now you getting kinky. I don't know. I don't know. That's nasty though. If you're home doing that, this your asses. Wait, so, so so for a nigga to dump his load in your ass, that's nasty. It's a load, yeah. Why would you do that? That's You're lying, Bodie. You got your ass dumped in before. Right, Bodie, look at this. Whatever. Look, Let's look, move on. Look, I said saying, on the ass cheek. That's what we was talking about she, today. The ass cheek. I got okay because I extend you with the cat, and I suggest y'all do. If he don't do the dishes, he don't take the trash out. Don't fuck him. I'm gonna tell you why good guys are losing though, right? We living in a world where it's based off the education of the upbringing, and, and Mona could be able to back this play. If I, stop me if I'm lying, Mona. A lot of girls, they grow up and they oh, see. They, come on, man! Like, no, I'm fixing my my my, my sneaker. your feet and shit. Like, no, I'm fixing on, my, my, my tongue. You fucking loser! <laughs> you goddamn nut! But listen, a lot of a lot of women grow up right, as young girls, and they see they're educated by their upbringings. A lot of times, they see their moms, they they big sisters, they get treated like shit. So that's 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 something that they're attracted to because they see it always stay around. For sure. Motherfucker, treat your mom like shit or treat your sister like shit, and you're a young girl watching it. And a nigga keep getting rewarded. He ain't leaving. He's, he's this, the, the big piece of steak. He always he always get the big piece of steak, and he ain't get rewarded. Uh, cuz, cuz, hey, Tootie, what's going on, Tootie? <laughs> Nothing. How you doing? Uh, we we got you on the show. I just want to ask you a question. Gil is right here. Has it ever been a time, Tootie? And don't fucking lie. If don't lie for Gil, has it ever been a time where he couldn't get up and his shit wasn't you know rock hard? That wasn't. Maybe when he first came home from jail. <laughs> what? Oh, <laughs> ding, ding, ding. Oh, no, Thank no, no. you, Tootie. 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 Listen, listen, I was fucking the juice up in there, you and it wasn't until day juice. eight when a nigga said, yo, yo, you know that juice is to stop soft your dick Peter. from getting hard, right? So I'm like, I'm like, what the fuck you mean the juice stop your dick from getting hard? It they does. like, it's something in the juice that stop your dick from So I'm like, I've been locked up for eight days. My dick ain't been hard. <laughs> now that I think about it. But why would your dick be hard in jail? Thanks but for your honesty, My nigga, Tootie. when you wake up in the morning, a lot of times you your dick hard. Just because your dick you, broke. Tootie. Just because your dick's broke, my dick ain't broke. When you wake up in the morning and your dick is it's filled yeah. up with piss and overnight, you're supposed to wake up with a semi-hard dick or something. So just because your dick's broke, Tony the broke dick, dick was out. Tackle it. God damn, Tony the dick, broke your dick so, so listen, I didn't know about the juice. So when I first came home, so when I first came home, my dick was a little lazy. I was nervous too. Oh my god, <laughs> my dick was out. I'm about to I take need some pills. <laughs> hey, hey too, he went got some pills too. Tootie, to you gave some pills. No, he just was like, oh my god, I'm sorry. He was like, I think it's. The juice. I was he was busy. He said, I'm he sorry. Said, he so said, sweet. I'm sorry. My piece is out. Tootie is so sweet, My piece is out. Like, beauty in the hey, beast. Hey, hey, he apologized. I'm, I'm hold sorry. Up, hold the fuck up. Why you gonna say and say I said I'm sorry? Too? You know how to say no <laughs> shit like that. Too. You, <laughs> you gonna say you on this fucking podcast somebody I said I'm sorry when my dick was out. My dick was my dick. I'm sorry. Can y'all see the visual? I'm sorry, babe. I'll make it up next time. I'll make it up, baby. I'll make it up next time. I'm sorry. I'll make it up, baby. I got the visual in my head is never gonna leave. Oh, shit. All right, two, get the fuck off this phone. All right, two. We out of here. Thank you, two. She's a fucking nut, too. Blaze the top of I said, I'm sorry. I blaze the. Listen, don't drink that juice. You just learned the lesson. First trip in the counter, don't drink it. First drink. But you know what's crazy? That juice so vicious that in, in jail, the juice that they give you is it mixes it in its pack. That if it spill on this table, that shit stains the table. Yes. You can't even get that. So you drinking this, you can't even get the table. Like it might be red. 
You would try to wipe it off the table. That shit would be there for like a month. Forever. Oh. It never comes That shit up. stains the table. Imagine in the kitchen. what it's like, going to your so inside. I drank that shit. That shit was good, too. I ain't going to lie. That, that shit like it was cooler. But y'all that heard that, that it good. don't get you hard. I heard that it makes you not be able to have infertile. children. Yeah, I yeah it was for infertile. the women, yeah. that's what they say. But it's like that jail rumor you that get there, people tell you shit. I think it's real. Yeah, you were sick. You thought, oh, my What did you say to yourself? I'm sorry, too. I'm sorry. You talk to your pizza. No, no. Get up. Don't do it. We had conversations. Don't do me like this. Does he have a name? You got to bounce back. I'm sorry for drinking that juice. I didn't mean don't, to do don't, that to Don't put me out the game too <laughs> don't early. Don't put me out the game. Does he have a name, early. Gilly? How old was you then? I was like, I don't know. I was like 30, 30 maybe. Yo, the, the dudes be going out the game at that time. Man. Does <laughs> he have a name? Like Walter. Hey, what the no, fuck? Travis. Did, I ain't got to name my piece. <laughs> my cat's name <laughs> Tabitha. My piece named Killer. Fuck you, Travis. Tabitha. Tabitha is mine. I call her Tabby. My piece named Killer Cat. <laughs> F- fuck is wrong. That's weird to have a name Kill for your penis. <laughs> yeah, I ain't never named him. My kitty cat's named Tabitha. I call her Tabby <laughs> for short. But listen, this, this what yeah. happened though. She didn't Tabby. even catch that. She didn't even catch my name. Kill, Kill a cat. Kill a cat. Kill a cat. <laughs> I called it. Fuck it. You did. You slow as well. No, but see this Kill the whole thing. Kill Tootie Cat. That's about it. Your name is sorry, nigga. I'm, gonna I'm say sorry too. I'm sorry. I'm gonna say this moment. At the end of the day, it's like this. A lot of women grew up and they see. They don't, they don't fuck with nice guys because a lot of times they never seen nobody fuck with nice guys in their family. Right. And everybody be on Instagram, oh, it's so toxic. I don't want to get toxic. Stop fronting. You know that's all you love. Mm-hmm. Why do they love the dumb shit? Yeah. I mean, I think for the most part, we raised out of fear instead of love. When a child's raised out of love, they make decisions out of love. When you raised out of fear, you make decisions because you're scared shit going to happen. You know what I mean? Like scared on what? What do you mean? Like, let's say you get in with a person that is financially stable versus a person that really loves you. You know what I'm saying? It's a total different type of relationship. But you scared to be broke. You scared to be evicted. Something you might have seen your mother do. So you might lock in with the mean guy that's not giving you anything for your soul, but he giving you everything financially. Damn. The mean no, 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 but that, 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 that ain't always the truth. Because these niggas don't give you nothing for your soul. All they, and they don't give you nothing for your pocket <laughs> all either. All they give you is something for your whole. They want to blaze the hole. They just Hard all they dick give and bubble gum. Uh, uh, no dick and problems. <laughs> D and P. Let's not get it fucked up. No, thank you. <laughs> At the end of the day, I think that. Let me tell you something. This is how I be going in life. When a woman got a, a man that she got to be concerned about, and it's like they spend too much motherfucking time. Concerning themselves on this nigga and what he doing and who he talking to and who Instagrams he on and da, da, da. but when they get that nigga that oh he go to work he come home perfect dude don't go out hi I'm Johnny uh, perfect hey, I'm Johnny perfect look at me they be the niggas who they catch they woman with the dick in their mouth because they woman That's they, 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 they they hoes bro. No no no, 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 because they, because I ain't got, I ain't got, I ain't got to worry about you. I know what you do. You cold work, you come home, your whole life is based around me. That's it. Now she out with the dick in her mouth. <laughs> like, damn, this is what you ask for. You know how many, every, and this is some real shit. I ain't going to say no names, but every homie. That I got, that that's a good nigga. Johnny Perfect. I'm talking about a good nigga. Never fucked up. Never got caught cheating. Never did. What'd you none say? Of never that got shit. caught. Was they cheating? No, you said no. No, I don't, no, no, no. I don't know. Don't but what I'm saying is, they, they they never got caught. None, none of that shit. They all caught they bitch with a dick in her mouth. No. <laughs> Are you serious? Every last one of them. God damn, God damn it. Every <laughs> last one of them. Up. Every <laughs> last one of them caught they bitch with a dick in their mouth. God, that sucks. Mm. I'm just saying. So to me, it just seemed like the good guys finished last. And I'm not saying that you can't be. But let me tell you something. All, this is another thing. All the niggas that I know that don't stand up for themselves. Hey, Tony, woman, they, him and his woman get into an argument. He tap out. All right, babe. All right, babe. He dead right tapping out. All right, babe. All right, babe. You right, babe. You right. I don't want to argue, babe. Your woman got a dick in her mouth. Oh, my God. <laughs> Just know that. How? God damn, How do you God damn the two, Gilly? Oh, How? my God. How do you correlate the two? <laughs> Maybe he don't like to argue. All right. Um, no. No. <laughs> Explain to let me. me. Tell you, okay, let me just tell you something. <laughs> You got a sausage when, in the mouth. When you, when you, when you are ultra super 
Oh bitch my. ass nigga. Yeah. <laughs> Guess who know first hand users ultra Your woman, super Your woman bitch for ass. sure. All right. Guess who talked to a girlfriend? I love Rodney, but he's, he's a, a bitch. Big pussy. I just wish he just tell me shut the fuck up sometimes. One time. I just uh, some of them bitches be sitting around like I wish he just fucking backhand me just once. Just just tell me, bitch, shut the fuck up. Like I just say whatever I want. He do. All right, baby. All right. I'm a fucking duck. Look at my feet. Watch me quack. So you think it's the respect? You don't respect him enough to. No. Hold that pussy the, down. The, first of all, first of all, a lot of these niggas is in bootleg relationships. A lot of these niggas' relationship with bitches they don't deserve. There That's you the go. problem. There you go. That's the problem. The problem is you ain't caught or you bought a nigga. You're afraid to lose a nigga. Mm-hmm. I ain't afraid to leave nothing I can fuck when the heat's around the corner in 30 seconds. Heat, nigga. We um, out of here, baby. Right. Fuck is wrong <laughs> with you. That's one thing my woman knows. Never get attached to anything that's, you can't walk away in 30 seconds flat if you feel the heat coming around the corner. Absolutely. That's one mm. thing my woman knows. Mm. My woman knows I love her to death. My wife know if a nigga pulled out a gun on us right now and said, pick one of y'all, they ain't even no motherfucking choice. Come on, let's get this shit that's over good. with. He waiting on me. Ain't even no rap. Go ahead, baby. You good. Any of my kids, any of that. But my wife also know that. I ain't got no suck ass nigga. He catch me with dick and balls in, in my mouth. He's gone. He's exiting. Deuces. Okay, I have a question. So, let's say you were to cheat and get caught. Should she just go? Like, I just feel like when no. women cheat, they, like a woman can literally. <laughs> Touché. We, we like, du- literally, a woman Nate, Nate can. Fuck that, right? <laughs> we, hey, hey, look, we got double standards and shit like that. Like, that's no, really, <laughs> like a woman can literally get caught with a text thread. Where the guy is like, I like you, I like you, I like you, I like you. And then the day that she send the emoji kiss back. He like, bitch, I can't believe you did this shit. And no, that's listen, it. Listen. I'm gonna say, oh, I'm gonna no, say he's a quote. fucked your cousin. I'm gonna say from a like, Twitter. What the fuck? If a Twitter. nigga was blazing Tootie, he put work in. <laughs> Tootie is that nigga low, been around for a minute. Tootie is low key in love with this nigga. But what about this? The, ain't no, you can't, you can't fuck my bitch on it. What's up? I'm saying I got right. some cold. Oh, what if it was a side, a, side nigga got, Sunday? Joint. I got a couple dollars. That's what I was thinking. Yeah. What if it's side nigga Sunday turned into something longer? Now, Side Nigga Sunday could have turned to something. The sparks could have been flying. Side Nigga no, 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 Sunday no, no, no. at 12 is Monday. Because no, 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 Tootie only fuck with the young bulls on Side Nigga Sunday. So I'm she ain't going to take no young Like young bull with the... Yeah. Okay. She, take she ain't really got his shit together. No, he ain't got his shit together. She look out for him. Right, take him right, on the date. Right. All right, it's great. Right. She ain't going to leave you. You feel what I'm I saying? I like the idea but, of that. But so if you got a woman... And she worth anything. A nigga just can't not going to be able right. to fuck so your woman. So you know it was more... Right. So, That's true. That's so, a good point. So so guess what Toot going to do? She going to sit on the phone. She had long talks with this nigga. She done told this nigga my business. Facts. Because <laughs> she's trying to justify why she's ready to give you some pussy. Facts. I don't just know. He just be working my nerve. He be stressing me. I can't take this. How you know he, all this? He's on, he's don't work no more. Who no. fucked and told his secrets? I'm juice. sorry, babe. I'm sorry, babe. His dick went out from drinking that juice. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't even to say. <laughs> <laughs> no, could you justify if your piece go out? If your piece go out, could your bitch cheat on? Come on, could she? Yeah. She got a right. She get a pass. If your piece, if your piece don't, Unless if you your piece you out. So for these boys out there, your piece went out on they done. No, 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 no. If your piece go oh, out, you your bitch can't cheat. You know why? Because <clears throat> I'm gonna keep it all we real. A lot of these bitches' pieces don't want out. For sure, dry. It's a, it's a dark spit fucking hole. <laughs> How do you know when the chick piece go out? When you put, when, when you, when you, when, when you put your dick in and then your hip in. Like throwing a hot so dog down a hallway. Yeah, you got to get the bitch dick in the hip. But you got, damn, bitch, my whole hip in there. Little toe, too. The no, I ain't going to front. I, I had. Because remember, remember when we was younger and you fucked the bitch, remember back in the day? Yeah, go ahead. And you put your balls in a pussy. That pussy was gone. You put <laughs> balls, you put balls in somebody? Yeah, he, he put everything in a pussy. <laughs> How big are your balls? Because I put my dick in my balls. <laughs> What? That's a hell of a point, though. Oh, like, no, that was somebody. That we pussy knew. was gone. That was somebody we, that was, we, ain't, gonna name, we ain't gonna name. Elephant don't name pussy. We ain't gonna name or blame her. That pussy. But I will was say gone. this. Start pussy. I will bad say pussy? this. No, no, no. I will say this. I didn't have some pussy in my journey through life, and no bullshit. <laughs> it was this one girl that me and him know that I had blazed out. Listen, I went to well, I went to go blaze it, and the shit was real awkward. Why? You know what I mean? She she jump on the bed. She. Cracked that thing open. There's no bullshit. One of my dead homies came out the pussy. Shut the fuck. There was no bullshit. It was all type of niggas what in there. What is he talking about? I was like, what the fuck, nigga? Where you oh been at? Like a I spirit. Thought you was, I thought you was dead, nigga. Well, shut up. Niggas came out the pussy, man, and all type. It was a street corner. 
She had a street corner in her coochie. Niggas just started posting up on the block. Bad pussy Niggas is was relative. smoking reefers in there. I said, You can go off a cool size it. and shape of the reefer. actual I'm cat, cool. yeah. and then the you can judge them off listen. of the sex. That's two different things. But if like, the coochie good, she don't have to know I was how to like, fuck. It was, it's cool when you don't, you don't, it, it's different when. You're seeing dead people. I'm <laughs> telling you, it's cool when the, co- Man, the coochie. Man, this nigga said the bitch had a street corner in her coochie. The street corner just popped up. This shit was all over. Niggas was all over the bed. Nigga, what's up, nigga? Niggas was rolling weefer. Niggas was selling coke all the time. I said, I'm getting the fuck out of here. That shit was different. Hey, yo. Oh my god! It turned into a repass. I don't repass. know what the fuck he yeah, talking about. But let's get to our second sponsor, man. I mean, let's get into a second. You know, our, what I mean? this this. Uh, let me see, man, because this motherfucker got me confused. This motherfucker talking because he bitch. lying up here. He said the bitch had. He said that shit was crazy. Rolling reefer on the motherfucker bitch pussy. He said the bitch had a street corner and a coochie. After this, after this, after this uh, sponsor, I'm gonna tell you about the chick that told up told me I had a pregnant. And I had two hats on. Oh shit, bro! You wore two rubbers, bro. If you got wear two rubbers, you shouldn't be fucking. No, up. I had listen. No, no, he wanted. He, want to, he wanted to make his dick appear bigger. Uh, no, he I wanted didn't. to fit no, the magnum, so he why. put a no, lifestyle no, no, on to fit the magnum. I, I wore two hats because listen, I, it used to make me go crazy long. This when I was young. Man, let me. This what episode of Me and I Was Worth a Game is brought to you by Amazon Music. <sighs> no one makes this time of year wonderful. The music and getting the holiday music fixed with Amazon Music. Haven't tried Amazon Music before? For a limited time, you could get your first three months of Amazon Music unlimited for free. So that's 90 days of unlimited music for free. Amazon Music. It gives you access to more than 70 million songs on demand and ad-free. So ain't a bunch of talking going on, a bunch of commercials, and you know you can play whatever songs you want, when you want, free See, that's the that's the main word. Free. You know what people love? Free shit. Free stuff. So your first three months is free. You can play Mariah on repeat. You can play Young Thug on repeat. You can play I Gilly Gilly you. Neighborhood music on repeat. My my music wasn't no neighborhood. Get music. down on the ground. Like, stop saying that, bro. Get down on the my, ground. My, neighbor, my, my music was worldwide, man. But, gee, you can also play Gilly on Amazon Music. <laughs> and you can download, you know, the app and get access to millions of podcasts. Episodes, no charge, plus thousands of music stations and top playlists. So get in tune with Amazon Music right now. You can listen at home or wherever you want. You feel what I'm saying? Limited time. New subscribers can get three months of Amazon Music unlimited for free. Go to Amazon.com backslash millions. That's Amazon.com backslash millions to get your first three months free. Free. Let's go. What you were saying about the two hats? Well, I had I had put two hats on because two hats made me go longer because my, my piece was sensitive when I was growing up. <laughs> a little bit, a little bit of, I'm talking a little bit of wetness. I was done. <laughs> I was shooting. A, listen, you I ever was came on a leg before you even got it in the cat? No, sometimes because I cue my piece up. I'm good with curing my piece up. I don't think it's nothing wrong with prepping your piece, rubbing out first, then you go. No, the it wasn't time. about rubbing it out because I was a vicious titty boy. I like to, you know, you know, what I mean, suck a little titty in there, play with the piece, warm him up. And sometimes it got a little crazy, and I, you know, sprayed the place. Damn. You know what I mean? So, right. that, so that shit happened, but I did have two ass girls. Titty play is childish, Wallow. That was back in the day. Oh, we back in the day. Yeah. All right. Something give me, you still sucking the titty for half an hour, but whatever. <laughs> Let me ask you a question. Inside. You don't think that's the old thing? That's the shit no more? I mean, goddamn, half an hour. Like, go to the here, cat. What you going to say to the men out there that suck titties? I mean, I'm saying visit, Grow up. Visit that's them. what I'm going to tell you, niggas. Titties. Hold on. So you're not supposed no, to suck titties? No, you can't. No, no, no. Listen. She you talking. visit them. And women, visit the men. Men like their nipples licked, too. No, no, don't no, believe no, nothing like they I, say. I, I, I like when my nipples get licked. See? Get them nipples licked. Ladies, don't forget to lick the nipple. Fuck little fuck twist, little about. bite. You know, people into that. But men, visit the titties. Like, we wait for you. God, God damn it. That's fucking me up. You Men, we want you to visit the titty. Like, go on a VI, but then go right to the cat. <laughs> like, don't waste too much time on these titties. Go to the cat. Tom. <laughs> we learn more and more shit about you. Hey, like, it's nothing wrong. Don't I'm let them. Don't I'm let them bully you. Shit, you. Okay, I'm so, in tune with my shit, bro. So let's just, let's they about just to re- run you let's down just with recap. this. You know, all the shit we've learned from Tone in the past month. Okay. Oh, my God. If he's in a room with four bitches, 
He's fucking all of them bro Damn What you mean damn Where the fuck was I When we talked about that I so, so Tone What's wrong with that is it, is Tone loves his so, titties so, so, Hold on Mona look, Let me ask you a I'm question Mona, you, Mona Hold on wrong with that, Hey Mona So if I'm having a, a foursome Right Four bitches Fivesome okay. Right Wow If we having a fivesome Yes Why would I wear a rubber Diseases. God damn right. That's what I was saying. Eight. So we, we I can tell you why we're going to No, we're going to get them checked out first. You guys are clean, bitch. No, 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 no. Ain't no me. Like, come on, man. Tone. Like, come stop, on, man. Stop, stop that saying this, shit, bro. You're not getting no bitches. I want all five of you bitches. Go to the clinic first. Exactly. No. Like, come on. You're we going met in a club, the, bro. You in Vegas. We met in the club, bro. I'm fucking four of them raw, man. Fuck what you talking about. Stand on that shit. I'm standing on my shit. Fuck it. If I'm having an orgy, I'm having a fucking orgy. Who has an orgy to put a fucking rubber on? This nigga's not wearing two rubbers. I'm not wearing none. You know what? You a real Real nigga for saying no, that. No, 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 the fuck. Why he real nigga? Because no, no, he said no, no. it out loud. He's a crazy fact. nigga. Fuck is you talking about? Do niggas think he, like that? He, he talking about why would Fucking I wear right. a rubber? Uh, chlamydia, Dump or die. AIDS, herpes. Trick of mortis. Trick of mortis. Well, fucking so hepatitis. Raw pussy blue hepatitis. A the blue waffle. Z. They got a. They got so a. That's a lie. Though. They got a so you ain't never hitting the raw pussy. playing. The blue waffle's a lie. You ain't never hitting the raw real. pussy. You got. You got I like. I never said I never hit no I'm raw I'm, pussy. We talking about quattro. He talking about party pussy. No, never. No, he never. Talk, I used to be on tour. So, so I used no, to no, listen. No, no. So, so I used to be on tour. Bro, number two song in the country. Hoes, you ain't on. You ain't hoes, the fuck fuck back the bitch. Bitch. I, I call Speedo right now. He'll tell you no. We used to stab them bitches like Chucky. But they get with stay, Speedo on, on the line. Raw. Get Speedo on the one line. Fucking capping, raw. That's why I love it here. A million dollars worth of game. Everything is fucking um, um, official. Capping, get Speedo on the line. We ain't the number two song in the country. I don't, you tell me I don't you got do no jumping all over you. And you gonna tell me none of them bitches getting no raw dick? No, they didn't get no raw dick, man. Listen, I, do, I wasn't really well, shocked. Get, well, let me tell you something. If I got four of them motherfuckers, they getting it raw, okay? Oh, Lord. Damn, that's <laughs> crazy. Dump or die or you pull out? You dumping in these bitches? Oh, no, 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 no. You living that, dangerous that. if you coming in these let bitches. Let me ask y'all a question. No, is, no, no, is side no, no. Bitches, I like it. Is side bitches the new wifey? Yeah. No, 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 no. Fuck no. Yes, they are. So I bet you have Damn, you to fucking jail. That nigga just pulled off a gilly. Oh, no, 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 no. They will have you to fucking jail. How? A side bitch will have you in jail. I can tell you firsthand. I, 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 I feel side like side bitches get jealous, man. They want to replace the wife every single time. They cool with the situation until the situation is like where they want more. And they going motherfucking, they, they coming for everything. I had my side bitch. Y'all already know about my side bitch motherfucking set my shit off. Damn. She sent pictures, the email, itineraries. Right? No, no, no. Everything. No, 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 no. Everything to the wife. No, no, no. But see, it's a difference because I feel like in today's generation, today's society, was going on side bitches is the new wifey mm -hmm. because it, it, in my day you had a wife this was a certain you didn't remotely treat a side bitch like you treated your wife facts like that shit's not even close <clears throat> now you got niggas who buy their side bitches cars oh, no. <laughs> yeah. oh hell no you got niggas who they get they bitch a Christian Dior bag and they get they side bitch a Louis Vuitton bag. Yeah. They get they bitch some they get their wife some red bottoms. They get they side bitch some red and bottoms. You got side True. bitches so, that be on the be on the gram, they mad <coughs> that, that you bought your wifey something. Mm -hmm. So Max. now Big Max. So I'm now saying, I didn't see him players go. So now it. you done damn near gave your side bitch the power to feel like She's on your wife level because the same thing you doing for your wife, you, you doing, doing for, for the side, side bitch. This nigga preaching today, that's a fact. But you ain't even got to do that. I think so, it's in the so, men. So when you say it was your side bitch, no, 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 no. It was talk. you. It was you. Exactly. You invested a lot in that bitch. It was you. She got no, too before, much. Before, you had an no, no, apartment no, 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 no. with the bitch. No, no. You so, had a so, house hold, with your wife. False. You had an apartment false. with the bitch. Hold you on, told her I know the story. Hold on, but you No, no, you don't. No, you don't. This is before she got, before we got to that stage, this motherfucker was already... She was in her own spot with in, in, in New Orleans, motherfucking just. Hey, I can't take my bitch out of the country. I go, I take my wife out of the country. She jealous that I just took my wife out the fucking That's country. That's the shit we talking about. But, the but, 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 but she had never been out of the country, and the other bitch had. Oh, she was up. She came to Atlantic City, sucked a little dick, and went back to fucking New Orleans. Okay, but at the end of the day, <laughs> at the end of the day, right? <laughs> at the end of the day, right? That's your fault. Yeah, I agree. Because when you took your wife outside the country. And a bitch called you and said, 
You took your wife outside the, the country. country. You should have said, uh, bitch. bitch, lose my number. Facts. Oh, no, right. she, didn't call, she didn't call me. You she called said, my wife. Uh, uh, Damn. Yes. But Tone. She looked on she Facebook. Alive? But Tone, the by the Facebook time she called your wife. And, and but Tone, by the time she called he your wife. damage was done Y'all was already knee deep in. Yeah. Like, you had already had an apartment with her. No, that's not true. That's not true. This is when I first met the bitch. This is getting She heated, called guys. your wife when you first met the bitch first and you bitch. still fucked with her? Hey, I took a couple L's in that. In that that pussy was good. That was, the head. Head. that was some magnificent It was, it was a combo. Hey, 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 I'm going to tell you right now. I think it made a hit. Who's the lady in New Orleans with the magnificent pussy? I never give it DM me, no girl. Clout. Let's talk about it on I live. I never give it no clout. Oh, DM wow. me, girl. Hell okay. <laughs> no, I agree with Gilly. I think that the man sets the tone, and I do agree with back in the day. Like, back in the day, a nigga wouldn't dare. He was almost more rude to you just to keep it official. Like, yo, you're not that important. I think you niggas make them women feel too too important. Right. You know what I mean? You're involved with too much. And I think y'all the lie. number... Y'all you're going to say y'all cool with it. Well... And then flip. That's the thing about me. I haven't been a side piece. How many bitch. times you been a side piece, Mona? How many? Probably like two or three times, Was right? they joined? But what, what, did, you, did you ever get out of pocket? As a side piece? Fuck no, never in my life. Even when, even when the heat is the, the worst situation was, um, I didn't know. And his wife called me, held it down. A- like, educate all the women busy. how to be a good side chick. Number mm-hmm. one, What's the rules? Number one, it's, a, it's mm-hmm. an old saying that go, I've been a side bitch so long that when the phone rang, I just get quiet wherever I'm at. Because you're Damn. supposed to shut the fuck up. You know what I mean? Ooh, like oh, heavy. Mm. The first thing I would do, you fucking with a guy with a bitch, I would block or find a way to not follow her. So if you did follow her before or y'all did have any type of exchanges on social media, shut that down. And I wouldn't follow him either for your own feelings. You know what I mean? Mm. Um, number That's rule two, number one. Number you two. You gotta now. know that you that this should be rule number one. You gotta know that you built for it. Like right now in my age, in my early 30s, I'm not built for that side bitch shit. I need a lot of attention. I'll be hungry and shit. Bitches? I think it's a mental state. Like in my early 20s, I didn't want to be okay, nobody's so, wife. So, you understand? Okay, okay, I didn't even on. want that spot. Okay, so it was so perfect for me. Rules, it was perfect for me. So you level one, you got to be make sure that that's something that you want. Like in particular, if you're the type of girl that don't want to share a space with a nigga, you don't want a nigga to live with you, then yeah, that's a good situation because this nigga can't answer the phone at the 8, 9 p.m. If you had any fucking home training, bitch, you wouldn't call at the 9 p.m. That's just the right thing to do and you remember when it will be your spot you will be the main bitch karma is real you don't do that and the worst thing you do is when you get that call you still humble yourself and say hey you got the wrong number i don't that's not my kitty cat those are not my fingernails that's my brother Mm. hold that nigga down especially if he holds you down okay let me ask you this question so you said right now you ain't at a side bitch stage but you meet a nigga right he coming to you coming to your life y'all go to a couple dinners right you feeling this nigga? I'm talking about you feeling this nigga with both hands and feet. You ready to suck the leather off this nigga? And he sock it to your pocket and like he a generous, rock. And he you, ready, you ready to suck the balls out this nigga's dick? Jeez. And he like, listen, I'm gonna keep it all real with you because you a real bitch. Yeah, you know I mean, I, I'm in a relationship. Yeah, you know I mean, but let me tell you something. <laughs> you and my pocket is in a relationship. So <laughs> that's how professional. What what mm-hmm. we doing? Huh? Matter, of fact, matter of fact, before you even answer that, that's, that's for you and the kids. You know what I mean? Don't even mm, count that. Wait I till, love wait, you hold, and the kids. Hold on, wait, hold on. Ooh, hold on. Hold on. What? Hold on. Wait till you leave to count that. That's for you and the kids. That's, to, that's just for you to think about. God damn. On, that's just for you to think about. Is he about. real? Listen. Yeah. That's wait just for you to leave. think about. Call this nigga. You feel me? Right. Wait till you don't open that right now. Wait till you right. count that right. Damn. All right. Y'all finish having dinner. Y'all laughing, joking. Same as going on. You leave, you crack that motherfucking envelope. That motherfucker say, "God damn, God damn it!" In there, mm. and then and then it's a little letter in there for this, the children. Hold on, there's a little letter in there, a little note. This is just the beginning, bitch. Change your life. Mm. You hear me? <laughs> what is you doing? You saying is you keeping the same mantra? Is you saying I'm you a forgot t- the part when he tell me about his bitch? I ain't know. No, no, he just told you about his bitch. Yeah. I got a woman, oh, but listen, God. bitch, I'm in a relationship. But you and my pockets is in a relationship. Oh, okay. You Fuck. didn't fucking hear that? To be honest, honestly. It depends on how much in that envelope. Yeah, fuck it. Because, I mean, and, and it be like, literally, like, for real. What's the, you minimum, and the, kids? What's the minimum it could be in there? What do he say? You and the kids. Because you got some emotional Minimum piece. or maximum? The minimum it could be in that envelope. 
Shit, for me to be a side, it's like a little 10,000. Damn. Damn, yeah, more than 10,000. Listen, fuck, listen, no, seriously. <laughs> I am soft hearted. Y'all see this big persona and all that? You don't answer the phone. I don't I feel a type of way. You don't return my call, I feel a type of way. I don't want to set you up wait, for wait, that. Geez, wait, 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 wait. I'm soft hearted. How you just going to get bitches to law? You got it, nigga. Because you, you, whatever you said, you, 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 you ready, definitely played. A lot played, of bras already fucked their money up. They already fucked their money up. Listen. And she definitely you. been a savage before. And a nigga, does, she definitely, yeah. a, she, a nigga definitely she answered the phone somewhere, <laughs> and she said something in the background. Nigga backhand the shit out of her. Nah. And she said, "It's the main thing you do. You don't fucking say nothing when that fucking phone ring. Because when phone fucking ring around here, I just shut the fuck up. I don't give fuck wherever I'm at. Phone ring at my mama house. I don't I say shit. I need to put this on the record. I haven't been a side bitch since my nigga, early twenties. At I'll my you, early thirties, I don't know about y'all, but I can't take it. I'm hungry. I'm horny. I want dick in the sand. Which at 3 a.m. I'm not going for that white so what, shit. Okay, so what if a nigga Damn. get... So what if, <laughs> I'm horny, not, and horny and hungry. That's how I go. I'm so older, a, bitch. I want to get hit and eat a sandwich. That's what I so, want. So what if a nigga give you dick and money? Damn, I'm I talking like, about good dick and money, too. But for listen, the kids. But listen, for the kids. <laughs> Fuck. For the kids. It's for the kids. What's the real minimum well, amount, the minimum? though? The minimum, yeah, the minimum can't be 10 wanna, Gs, though. She bullshit. Nigga put 800 in there. She calling me back. She bullshit like what? Nigga put 800 and fives in there and make it the look thick. The way you was talking oh. heavy, I'm thinking 10 bins, 8 no, bins. I was thinking, no, what's more, the real number, I was though? thinking more like 3,000. Yeah, that sounds like more realistic. Like you I was thinking more like, come on, come on. This is the truth, and this is the truth at the end of the beginning. Don't fucking fronting, Mona. PUA was giving out 12. Let's keep it moving. Um, at the end of the day, oh, so you going to also just to let y'all know she getting locked the fuck up soon. She was putting in false claims too. You won't be seeing her Say on Million Dollar Group again. Say sight. Hey. Sight. No, Don't you're going bring to that jail. shit energy to us. Oh, Listen. Right. Damn, so you really was doing negative <laughs> shit. No, don't no. put that energy on. No, I don't want <laughs> nothing. I'm a mom. I knew you didn't fuck good, right? Listen. On some Stories world. from the cell. <laughs> oh, no. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. That was the wrong no, one. No, that's where the story going to be coming from. Oh, yeah. <laughs> See, we'll be telling the story from the cell. <laughs> hey, yo, I was on hey, a million dollars with a game last hey, summer, y'all. Hey, let's, <laughs> get let's get to this next oh, day. Let's get to this next day. We got to finish this we conversation because a lot do. of women want to know about how to be a professional yeah, side One thing about Harry's razor that I love, if you see this clean shade right here, Harry's got five blades. I'm talking about they super sharp. They next level. I'm talking about these are the type of blades that wears though. You just keep shaving. You know what I mean? You don't you you will miscount how many times you shave. Every time you shave, it just feel fresh. It feel like you just cracked it out of the case. I'm talking about the handle is strong. I'm talking about the blades is sharp. And I'm talking about you to give you this fresh, clean shave. I'm talking about I'm talking about stand by their brand. Harry stand by their brand. Hundred percent money back guarantee on Harry's.com. I don't care what you got going on. You can just send it back. Oh yeah, no, I don't like this. But you're not going to do that. You're not going to get your money back <laughs> because you're not going to get. You're not going to. You're going to want to give them more money because how sharp the razors are and how clean the shave get. Mm -hmm. Harry's razor. I'm talking about. At the end of the day, to all our listeners, new U.S. customers can redeem a Harry's trial set at Harry's.com slash millions for just three dollars. I'm talking about one, two. I'm talking about three hundred pennies. For 300 pennies, I'm talking about something simple. 300 pennies, 12 quarters. You could get, I'm talking about Harry's. Well, you I'm can talking count. About, yeah, I can count. You like that, 12 yeah. quarters. Uh, 300 pennies, so that means that's uh, 30 dimes, stuff like that. You know what I mean? It took you a minute to figure that no, out. I didn't, I didn't take a minute to it's figure like it out. 10 know, dimes you know, is a dollar, <laughs> 20 dimes I'm is I'm telling you, you're going to get the whole thing. You're going to get the foaming gel. I'm talking about the aloe gel. I'm talking about the, 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 the blade. You're going to get the wade handled. On a, on a razor, I'm talking about this shit is unbelievable, man. One thing about Harry's is, man, they're going to take care of you. They're going to take care of you. That shade, that clean shade. To butt the naked. So, yeah, I like the butt naked. That's my thing. Harry, shout out to you. Niggas kinky. What are you talking about? We keep, no, we talking about, you know, just cl a clean shave. No judgment here. Yeah, it ain't no judgment. Get the clean shave. Go to harrys.com uh, slash millions and check out the clean five blades. Harry's razors. It's just like that. Uh-huh. Should I get into a million dollars worth of game? No, don't get into that. Aren't y'all so happy I'm here? Yeah, we happy you're yeah, yeah, here, but go, you shooting here. pornos talking about side, how to be Did a side piece. Did y'all miss me? What other rules you got to get them about the side piece? Listen, this is important. What's the real number, though? Because that 10,000 is some bullshit. I'm trying Tom, to figure something Tom, out. Tom, 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 I'll text you because this seems like personal. Yeah. Listen, what I'm saying to you is to avoid all the drama that comes with it, all the agony and the heartache and all that shit, just know you can handle that shit, girl. That shit's not a simple little thing. Fucking with somebody and being at somebody's disposal and then you can't talk to them. No happy holidays, bitch. It's Thanksgiving on Black Friday. Mm -hmm. Your Valentine's on the 16th. It sucks. What is the top reason side bitches fall in love and, and what, just go crazy? What, what, it, you know jealousy what? and envy no. of that woman. No, 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 no. Half the time she no, no, wants no, no, for the no, nigga because no, no, she know no, the girl. No, no let's come on. 
man, let's stop Look, it. Get this. So this nigga's crazy. <laughs> what is it then? What Side is it then? bitches deal with a nigga forever who gonna put that dick on him. Old head. Ooh, I just gotta go through get old head something. He be going in 15 minutes. He get me. I'm out. They don't, they don't fall in love with old head. No, they fall in love with that nigga who put that dick on him, who dick hit the back of that oven. Turn that sprinkler system the fuck on. What? Had a, have them explaining shit. I don't know why my fucking leg won't stop shaking. Bitch, because I put that <laughs> dick on you. I know why it won't stop shaking. What? Yeah. Good dick is fucking rare. The- well, you know, it's here. It's the best dick in the world is in this room. We know that. Just so happened, my luck. We didn't say like, that. I didn't, I didn't say you, that. Mona. The best dick in the world is in this room right now. I didn't say that. I, I did. didn't. Nah, I didn't. I I fucking and did. the best dick out of all of y'all is him. I know that. I think two would say the best dick in the world is in this room. No, no, no. I don't brag on that type of time. Y'all don't even know what good dick is. Shit. I, you right. I oh don't. my God. Period. You, you right. You way you said that. I Women don't know fake what it. You don't know if she like it or not. No, no, no. I know when that motherfucking motherfucker go like this. <laughs> Stop! Like, oh my God. I'm moving seats. I'm not sitting next to him no more. That's enough. You got it. What the fuck? Cut his mic. Cut his mic. God damn, you nasty. It's like, wait, hold on. It's a bucket in there. He is nasty. <laughs> He's nasty. This nigga is See, crazy. you know what? You, you know what? When you when them niggas fuck you, you hear this. Use a motherfucking lie. That's motherfucking this friction. Wet. Use a lie. That's, that's static gotta, electricity. This Gucci's immaculate. Ooh, that's why I don't argue with y'all about. Wait, that shit get warm. Wait, he be like this. Rug. Hold the fuck up. I have like, never had a required a spit start. Use a fucking lie. We we need to call somebody. Call somebody. Who Uh-oh. the Uh-oh. fuck? Uh oh. Who we calling? No. What's up? Uh oh. Call somebody. I'm calling. Call him. Yeah. Listen. Call him. Yo, Uh-oh. you know Mona. Drive pussy Mona. Yeah. DPM. Oh, don't call nobody. To call somebody. Uh oh. Put him right to the speaker. She gonna call her baby dad. All right. Them niggas hate me. She gonna call, we'll call her baby. Somebody. She gonna Listen. call her baby I'm dad. I'm calling. Oh, oh, she calling a little dumb. Why I gotta put it on no, speaker. No, 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 no fuck is you talking about? Hmm. What's his name? Jay. What's up, man? Hey, Jay. Hey, oh, oh, hey, Jay. Hey, Jay, this is Wild 267. How you doing, Jay? Hey, what's going on, man? How you be, man? We calling on behalf of Mona. We just got to ask you a quick question, Jay. Uh, Come on, man. Cut straight hey, to the up. chase. Y'all let it all. Did you ever have a moment where you had to spit start uh, Mona before you <laughs> fucked her? Oh, man. Nah. You're lying like a motherfucker, Best catch you ever had in your life. What's tell it, it, talk, Tell me about it. If you had a rated from 1 to 10, what, would you, what number would you give it? 50 ball. 50. Oh, he's sweet. He's oh, sweet. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Thank you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, Jay. Hold on. What's this nigga name? Jay. Jay. What's up? Did you ever get Mona butt pregnant? <laughs> <laughs> huh? Nah. Yo. Come on, man. Jay, no, Jay, Jay, right now. Jay, Jay Hang up, up on Jay. him, Jay. Jay, let me ask you one more question, Jay. Did, she, did she ever lick your gooch? <laughs> yeah, she got you. Yeah, she got you. <laughs> she looks at Gucci J. Gucci J. Gucci, Gucci J. J. New mixtape coming out. Mona Bye. got me. Bye. The new mixtape. Mona got Bye. Gucci Bye. J. Gucci hey, J. Hey, but, and the nigga hey, look, hook up, we can call another hey, hold on. Hey, hold on. Check call another one. This is Jay. What's up? Hey, look, check this shit out, though. Y'all ain't peep, though. Nick, Mona, she ain't had a nigga name saved in the phone. I don't store niggas. Damn, like you Gucci right. J. She damn. had Gucci J name saved in the You store, baby. You store. Gucci J. Mona got me volume one. You Delaware's store. finest. Ain't nothing wrong with licking a little gooch. Let's move on. Gucci I don't Jay. lick no ass. The gooch licker. <laughs> Gucci Ain't nothing mo. wrong with licking Gucci. Gucci mo. If you don't let a Gucci woman white. lick your nipples or your gooch or none of that, something wrong with you. Oh my God. You don't get the little Gucci. You don't get a little lick to the Gucci. Are you serious? You're <laughs> a fucking Gil. adult. Hey, hey, this nigga. This nigga you don't not, get he, a gooch he, lick. He, he not in tune with his sexual shit, bro. You ain't he, give hey, him hey, that corny. Hey, you, you not in tune with your sexual side, dog. No, Tuka this, get this the nigga balls. Had, this nigga had regular sex. Tuka get Gucci the balls. Yes. And, 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 Tuka corny. get the balls and right up under the balls, but she can't go too far. <laughs> That's the gooch. It's not yeah. the bowl. Okay, so you yeah, get your you, gooch you, lick. You went to the you went to the Gucci Gucci. No, the gooch is the gooch is the gooch. Let's get into me and Osworth a game. I need some game, OG. I got a good woman, but she's she has serious depression issues. So she takes her frustration out on me all the time. Even though I treat her good, she don't always mean to. It's getting to the point where I'm just like, damn, why do I keep doing this shit? She's loyal as fuck. 
She checks every dude that tries to hit her up. She's good to me, but lately her depression and moods are getting worse. Oh, that is. Would I be a bitch if I left her or should I just deal with it and try to get her help? That's a big one. Man, leave that bitch no. alone. No, no, nigga. First of all, this million dollars worth of game is see, they talking to me, nigga. So that's why they <laughs> that's why they ain't asking you, because you talk about leave the bitch alone. See? This is the reason why they asking me for this game. Give me the game. Now, let me just tell you something. What's the game? You gotta, see, when you got in a relationship, you knew she was suffering from depression, right? But the key word you said is, she lawyer was fucked. Any niggas try to turn, talk to her, she turned them niggas right down. Okay, so a nigga like me, I'm going to say, you know what? I'd rather get a shorty with depression than the bitches out here sexing and going to have a motherfucker stressing. <laughs> So you got to, ain't nobody perfect. I'm going to get her some help so that we can move on to the next stages of life because the main thing that come with her is loyal. Loyalty is hard right. to find these days. Right. See, you, you focus on the wrong shit. You need to be focused on getting some help. You going to go out there, get your bitch going to have you all on stressing me street, then you going to have depression, nigga. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Bitch going to drive you crazy, nigga. You know how hard it is to find a loyal motherfucker out here? You said Scressing Me Street? Stressing Me Street. This nigga's a poet. He's, uh, He's a poet. That's for real. Yeah, Scressing Me Street, that was a good one, though. You're a fucking groupie. You're, you're, I'm going to give him that. You're a fucking hater. You're a fucking hater because your vernacular ain't as spectacular as mine. There you go. When you done, I want to say something about that. You be stealing while I'm spilling, but that's another story. That's cool. Oh, y'all rapping now. Can I say something about what you just said? What? Mental health is a big deal. Nobody... It's in our community, it just seems like it's something that, you, you know, like almost like, yeah. for example, diabetics take insulin. Right. And that's totally normal. But if you take Zoloft for your depression, people look at you like you strange, like Fuck you weird. Them. Listen, I suffer from yeah. depression and anxiety. I have like since I was a kid. And I think you should just, you know, go to therapy or talk to a doctor. I think it's important. It's like your levels are off. Your gas tank's a little empty. All you need is a little bit of fluids. And what he said was right. Like if she's showing you loyalty, that's how you loyal back. You're not loyal back when she lose her job. That's petty shit. This is real shit to be loyal for. Like stick through it with this because that medicine will fix her. But you'll never fix a disloyal woman ever. And you, and you got somebody that's real solid mm. for you. Stay down for him and uh Thanks. you know everybody always talk about this loyal shit until they got to be the loyal one yeah hey but i want somebody that's loyal i want somebody to rob for me you better you better keep her right you better stay 10 toes down with her don't go tone where's Listen, his loyalty don't even move i'm telling you you better keep tone her said, uh, let tone go. and i want to say something okay. Hold okay. Let let tone Listen, we tone and i'm gonna say and i'm gonna say something that's real important <laughs> i'm gonna say something that's real important if you out there and you're going through depression or whatever, find somebody professional to talk to. Yes. You know what I mean? Because uh, everybody had their problems. Everybody don't look at yourself like you you something. And if anybody telling you know telling you some dumb shit or trying to you know uh, title you or trying to you know mm-hmm. uh, put put all this dumb shit on you like you ain't like you're normal, like you're weird, or you ain't normal. Right. Get the fuck away from them. Yeah. Right. For everybody sure. had their issues, but don't everybody. let nobody you know uh, try to make you feel less than who you are because you're going through something inside. You know, For everybody sure, got a right. different shit they go through. But anybody that's trying to put you down or trying to label you or try to, oh, you weird or you trip. No, nah, no, nah, uh, try to make you, be, you know, because of what you going through in life. Like you ain't, you know, like you all for you ain't no, and fuck Not them. Get, get them out your fucking life ASAP. Right. Yes. Right. And I don't know if this is a cure for depression, but I just know this shit help when I'm, when I'm depressed. Oh my God. What is Some it? Fucking, some scoliosis. <laughs> Some, stupid, some sloppy toppy. Like he, he had helped you with your depression. So what one one good dick sucker day would take the stress away. Fuck what's wrong Tootie, with you, man? Can we hear what Tony got to say about the depressed bitch? Lead a bitch. Nah, man. I'm just saying, stop trying to fix people that's broke, man. Like that's one of the things a lot of niggas be trying to do is trying to fix broke shit. Yeah, you gotta do your own thing. You gotta fix yourself before you fix somebody else. Even if she loyal, hey to man, you. that ain't your wife. Wow. Like that's one of the things. Like I, Tony I'm telling you, I, I know, if that's how you become your wife. No, right. no, 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 no. You go through them not, trials. Listen, yo. You know what I mean, motherfuckers like, out here broke. Everybody hey, broke. Listen, I agree with. Everybody I agree broke. You with think the fact a bitch that, meet that you mental, and think you that perfect, mental health is, is 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 something that's a priority, and you got to help people get their situation right. Mm-hmm. But that man can't handle it, and it's clear by what he was saying in the message. No, like, he can't. It wasn't it. clear because he said, "Should I do this, right. or should I get her some help?" So that's telling me. You ain't even got your chick no help yet. Exactly. He ain't. He didn't say, "Man, I don't got to help." We don't want right. to see a bunch of people. Man, the shit ain't working. No, right. yeah, I just said, "Man, let me tell you something." Nigga. Then it's time to You go. got to know when and to the hold them. Yeah, real shit. Know when to fold them. But him know just jumping the ship is disloyal, away. right? But he ain't even getting no help yet. Right. 
So, uh, see, my brain analyzes shit a little faster than y'all brain. That's cool. I'm left handed. Oh y'all right handed. Left handed. I'm a lefty, smarter bro. than people. I'm a no, lefty. no, 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 no. You right handed. I'm definitely lefty. Be. I'm yeah. ambidextrous. Definitely a lefty. They, they and I'm flexible. Job, they said your your amber your, your hamber dextrous because you were good at giving out hand jobs out there. Hand me? job two corkscrew. <laughs> Let's get I to this you. next oh sponsor. God. I taught you that. Please this stop next this sponsor shit, is brought to you by CBD MD. Everyone is everyone always talks about the importance of getting a good night's rest. But following the advice can be difficult. That's why the folks at CBDMD has created CBDPM to help you get the rest you deserve and feel your best every morning. CBDPM blends 500 milligrams of superior CBD with sleep-promoting ingredients like melatonin, valerian root, chamomile to create a powerful and effective sleep aid so whether you're up late with the kids pets binge watching netflix you can turn to cbd pm and get the rest you need to handle whatever comes your way all you got to do is go to cbdmd.com promo code game 25 percent off that's cbdmd.com promo code game and you get 25% off. You know I got uh, all the CBD products at the crib. You come over. <laughs> yeah, you see. Yeah, yeah. I got <laughs> bath bombs, topicals. I got all. I got everything. You know what I'm saying? So I should have put a little bit on my neck this morning. Cause my, yeah, this nigga walked in here like this. Yeah, I, I ain't know my joint was messed up. You get to talking that out. shit to Tootie. She bop, knocked that neck wrong. <laughs> <laughs> Shout out to Toot. This nigga can't even. He on. Oh. Uh, but make sure y'all go to cbdmd.com backslash game gets you twenty five percent off. So um, stories from the cell. These sound effects are fucking me up. Now, I'm These gonna say this: in Hollywood, this is one of the craziest moments in jail for me. Well, I had a, you know I had an associate of mine that they used to pay me. Well, really, I met him in jail. He didn't know how to read or write. Mm. Right? You'd be surprised. There's a lot of dudes that get money in the streets, but don't know how to read or write. It's crazy. So I used to write letters for him. I used to write letters to his, you know, his girl for him all the time. So <laughs> one of the craziest letters came through. You know, every time he come, he bring them to me. You know what I mean? I used to give him a list every week. He used to give me all this stuff from commissary every week. Mm -hmm. Just to write his letters. She used to write like two, three times a week. She was a, I'm talking about one of them girls, she was a registered nurse. Every time she had work, she writing these long ass letters, right? And I'm writing them back. You know what I mean? So it was a sport for me. And and this time I didn't have a, a shorty ride so, for me. So did you get emotional attachment to his bitch because you was writing letters That's back? A good question. He couldn't read or write. So did you feel like you was no. talking to his bitch? Like personal? it was both of y'all bitch. Yes, no, he did. No, no, but I did. Yes, feel he like, did. No, no, yes, no. I will did. say some real shit. I did not. I did not. But I mean, he got but, pictures sent. He told me, "Let me see them pictures. See what our bitch. What our no, bitch no, looking no, like no, this did, week? No, she was nice. I ain't even gonna hold you. But what happened? Did you was jerk this? off to his bitch? No. Yes, she did. Let me ask you a question. Did you did you ever jerk off? And think about any of your homies, bitches. Never, You're never. Lying. I never did no shit like that. Because why would I do that when I got all these porno books? Hey, I was a, I was a porno. I was part because of the porno. Because she coming to the after you seen a porno book fifty two times. No, that, it's that always shit something new. I always had access to new shit. And then when the, I ain't gonna front when the, when the, when the nightlife pictures came out when they started having the nightlife link. Yeah, nightlife link. Oh, that's a throwback. You know, you know what was so crazy? Because you might see a chick on there, she bodied up. And the whole time with this jerk, I'm thinking about a whole, I'm envisioning this whole joint like we going together. We got slid to the crib. Yeah, she had that on. How many she bitches you seen on, how many bitches you seen <laughs> on Nightlife you Link? Hold on. How many bitches you seen on Nightlife Link that was bodied up? And then you came home, them bitches look like stuffed vacuum bags. I seen a lot of <laughs> chicks that fell, <laughs> fell totally off. And I think they fell off because the game is a little different right now. I think a chick that's on the scene, I'm telling when I'm talking about the scene, it want to be going out, want to be doing. They got like a, a six to twelve month run, and they done. They even gonna be popped up, but they just some young girls gonna come and force them out. Or well, the Hennessy just make or them the bitches look old. Listen, the Henny, the Henny gonna tear their ass. Because I'm gonna up. keep it all the way real. I was at the, I had a little, you know, little joint I had to go to, and it was it was some young bitches in there. It was a bunch of them in there, but them bitches look old, man. Y'all bitches got to slow up on them drugs. Y'all bitches aging in dog years, man. That's what they saying. The drugs and the liquor is yeah, the like, drugs and the liquor like deteriorating y bitches, chicks. Right. Y'all bitches got to tell a motherfucker two ages. Like, like I'm 21, 41. <laughs> yeah, you know I mean? They age y'all and the age Real. you look. Well, yeah, you know I mean? Nigga like, Damn. Well, I'm 21, but I look 41 because all the Patron kicking my fucking ass and I, all I do is drink and get fucked on don't every night. No and I don't really get no sleep. 
and I just I just beat my whole body up. So by the time I'm 27, I'm going to be a burnt out little fucking gas tank. I'm going to be fucked up. A so I'm just telling you, bitches, you better stop. You bitches aging now, in dog years. Now, I'm going to say this. I get back to it. So we writing all the time. She was right. Like I said, she was the registered nurse. She used to write all this type of shit. You know what I mean? And it was like, i never forget this time. He said, damn, wow. <laughs> I mean, what'd she say? I said, man, she want to, you know, smut letter. Is that there? He said, write it, man. Write that joint. I'm like, and I'm going to just say this. I had to write the smut letter from the girl that he showed me the picture of. So I'm envisioning, you know, I'm just writing the shit. And, you know, I wrote that, this down the third, writing that. What'd number. you say? I can't wait to get home to breathe on your kneecaps. Jerk, on your, jerk off on your feet. No, no, All it wasn't. That it it wasn't a bunch of that. It was a bunch of like rough shit. Like, you know, like what? I came in a room. I threw the pillow on the, I threw the pillow on the ground. You immediately got out. You rich, you, you ripped my jeans apart from the crouch area. <laughs> shit like that. Right what? The WWF bullshit. No, it was is just that? crazy. It was some wild, wild shit. <laughs> wait, she liked why y'all get hey, your fucking jeans ripped, bro? Yo, you was. <laughs> why are we putting the linen on the floor? Why is the pillow on the floor? Wait, 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 wait. Hold on, wait. This is weird. Wait, 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 and I went ballistic. And you she started it. it off. I busted in. I grabbed the pillow and threw you on the floor. Not as if I threw on the floor. You cause. ripped my jeans off from the crotch area. What? It was some crazy the shit. Fuck? It was. It was because because from her being a writer, you know what I mean. And the stuff I used to write it regularly, I knew that she was more of a fancy, fantasy crazy drone. And some of the shit she used to say, because they used to have rough sex, so that's what it made me right from that. And uh, it was crazy, but fuck this nigga all used that. To be in the cell. Tell so me he about the, told you about the tell pussy. me about the sex you had. No, no, so right, like, right. no, no. She talked about it. it you oh, know, okay. So she kicked it off. But, but this was the twist of fuck all that. Okay. When she write the letter, because you know we write, but yeah, I mean, I'm going, to, I'm going to what's the name? This whatever the shit is, Cancun or whatever. Mm-hmm. I'm going to Cancun. This and that third. But I didn't know where the fuck it was back then. You know, I'm in jail. I don't know what that. You know, and I start hearing about it when dudes come to jail. Tell me, I'm going to Cancun. My girls are gonna be cool. <sighs> she wanted them straight, honest. Tell this nigga everything, type chick. She tell this nigga everything. Why she go to Cancun? And had a threesome with her girlfriend, right? Girlfriend is some nigga that was out there, whatever. Yeah, I just want to tell you, I don't want nobody to say nothing for you, but he ain't from Philly. This down the third, I'm like, <laughs> oh my god. So I'm so listen, so listen. Anything I love, I'm like. Damn. So I go to my old head. I'm like, listen, man. You know, and I ain't giving too much of the data because I'm like, I don't want to tell this nigga this shit. Like, I translate a lot of shit, but I ain't trying to tell this. And this is one of the, this is like one of the thickest letters she ever wrote. But I don't want to, you know, I just don't want to feel, I love you. It wasn't like you, she, this shit was thick. So I'm like, damn. And I don't want to tell none of the, it, for real, for, I don't want to ask none of these young cats. I never asked young cats nothing for no advice. So I go to the OG. I said, man, I got a home. You got a situation. Do I pose it like, how I supposed to play this out? Is I'm supposed to tell him or I supposed to protect his peace because he's doing some time right now or keep it to the chest and just like, how do I do this? He said, young, and that's, that's a real delicate situation because first of all, you're writing this woman and, it, and it's your duty. You know, he paying you for, you know, he paying you to do this. This, this is what he paying you for to, to translate everything back. So, you know, what you're not going to tell him? I said, but damn, it's going to throw him off. And it's I don't want to. He's going to stab me when I read it to him. No, 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 no. no he was bitch a bitch ass nigga. You gonna tell? I'd have read that shit. Yeah, and I was sucking dick in Cancun. <laughs> Imagine him reading you it. Yeah. Damn. He gonna come and fuck a nigga day. So listen. So listen. So the OG Damn, tell dog, me. She sucked the nigga dick from the back in Cancun, man. Listen. Listen. Yeah. But listen. Once again, this is this is the dude. We Everything is about him, him paying me to write. It ain't like he's my man, my walkie. Right. It's specifically for that. Yeah. Right. So what did you do, man? What Come did on. you do? What happened? I never told him. He's a fucking Damn, you nut. left it out? I ain't He's gonna fuck his whole joint. See what type of nigga he is? He protect the bitch. He don't protect. Protect, he don't protect, oh, don't protect the man. He protect the bitch. You're not doing what he paid no, no, you no, for. You, you, you know what? No. So he done came home. His bitch did. I married that nasty bitch. Yes, he did. What do you mean she nasty? She, she had a threesome. You she fucked a stranger a on a vacation. That's right. out of pocket. Mona, you just said a dude come in for twelve hundred dollars. You you know, and then you and the kids. I she said ten thousand. But he said she paid. Put the kids in there. The kids is in it. Come on, nigga. It's the kids. And you said you gonna get down on the ground. He's a fucking nut. I never said that. That nigga's a clown. You owe that nigga three suits because you left out of from the cell. Okay. <laughs> okay, it's over. I need one of them a- bitches. A tone. So you out here making a lot of motherfuckers money, man. Yes, sir. Yeah, man, we we've been having a really good run recently. Uh, I, I was in November. Hey, hey, I see it because I seen you on your shit. 
talking, bragging about how much money you made, motherfuckers, in November. What how much money you made, niggas, in November? Yeah, it's been a big month with Rona Proof. Uh, so far already, we're about $220,000 in deals mm. that uh, people have made money. So uh, shout out to my man. Uh, I don't want to forget y'all names right now. Uh, my man Kev, Kev just made twenty seven thousand first deal. He actually found me for a million dollars worth of game, which mm. is super dope. Um, Take care of people. Uh, another young boy just sent me a, a, a DM last night. I posted to uh, I posted on my story, but fifty seven hundred dollars first deal right here in North Philly. Uh, uh, I, I like doing those deals when I see these young guys. He actually just went straight to the Rona Proof, uh, Rona Proof dot com. Watched the uh, webinar. He didn't have the money to invest into the course. He just took the free training. Made fifty seven hundred dollars, so that was a dope one. Uh, my man Derek Haller, uh, Derek Haller just uh, total four hundred and eighty five thousand uh, dollars in the Rona proof, like for the year. Where he from? He from New Jersey, and he he actually does this part time, so he actually has a full time job uh, where he makes eighty five thousand a year, but he's made four hundred plus grand doing the Rona proof. So it's been a lot of people that's been killing it. So. If you've been trying to figure out a way to actually make money in real estate, no credit, no uh, experience needed, no license needed. Mm. Uh, I know some of y'all might have a, a, a bad background or whatever. You don't. None of that matters. You can literally get started flipping real estate contracts right now from home. You don't need much. You just need to get Wi-Fi, a laptop, and a cell phone. You can get busy. Uh, I teach the whole strategy free every Sunday, uh, 3 p.m. Do you need a cell um, Did you need a, 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 a laptop? Could you just do it off a cell phone? See, you you want to have a laptop just to be able to get access to to like the data and stuff. Uh, you can do it from a phone, but it just make it's just gonna be a lot harder to be able to do it. But you can do it from a cell phone. That's all you got. You got you know you can rock with it. But prefer you know preferences should be having a laptop. It's just gonna make your, your job a little so bit. So I easier. just lost my job today, and I don't have nothing going on. I just got my cell phone. I'm, and if I go to ruinaproof dot com, I get busy and I ain't got shit. I, I'm you know like yeah, I teach you how to get started like. The reality is I tell people, don't get misled by saying, hey, you don't need any money because at the end of the day, marketing is always important, right? So I tell people- So like, you got to pay for ads? You need, it's not ads. What you're doing is you're going to be trying to find these these people that may be, might be losing their house or something like that. So you got, you're got going to spend money on text messages or, or uh, things like that, but it's all pretty inexpensive. I teach people the, the cheapest way to get started. So- uh, I don't want to have anybody think like, I don't need no money because a little bit of money helps you with marketing, but you can get it done. If you flat broke, the kid just told you the other day, 5,700 bucks with, with, with really no, he just did it off, off the strength. Like you just wow. went and followed the steps. Mm. So Pretty cool. So look, text uh, Rona proof to 919-822-8525. That'll give you the link to the training. That's the free training. And that goes every Sunday, 3 PM. Uh, and we have replays if you miss it. So you definitely want to tap in Rona proof. Everybody making money. You need to be doing the same thing too. Believe that. Hey, listen, I appreciate y'all for tuning in each and every week, man. Making us the number one music podcast in the country. Go to barstoolsports.com. Get your merch. Get your merch. Get your merch. And let me give a shout out to my people over there, man. My people over there doing things in the community, helping people with the help, that daily dove care. I see y'all out there doing y'all thing. Much love to y'all, man. Keep doing events for the community, looking out for the community, and taking care of the people that owe the people that need the help the most. Follow me. Don't call me white girl. What else you got going on, white girl? Well, I'm on an album. Porn, porn hub. I'm on an album. The album that we started with. I'm on Blanco the album. Blanco 3. She's on Millie's album. Blanco 3. I'm on two different tracks. Check mm. me out. She rapping now. Don't let your nigga in. I'm mm. listening because he might. like Mixtape Mona. I mm. have <laughs> such a sexy deep voice. Mm. Yeah, I did something Mona. with Jasmine Sullivan. That should be coming out soon. You too. did what with Jasmine? Um, we, we had Girls Talk filmed. It was cool. Okay. okay you do. So, you make it shit yeah, happen. But follow me till you see what I've got going on. All right. right? I go by the name of Gilly the King. This is Wallow 267. I am Don't Call Me White Girl, and this nigga goes raw. Four times, one room, Tony the one night. Four of them, it's getting knocked down. Right! <laughs> and it's just like that! <laughs>